Magandang buhay mga katribu! Welcome back to my channel! Before we dive into our video, shoutout sa aking magaganda at very supportive channel members. Ayan po sila. Kindly visit their channels and please do support them. Thank you! And of course, shoutout sa lahat ng signing viewers, sa lahat ng OFWs, at sa lahat ng mga sumusuporta kay katribu. Thank you so much for all the love and support. To all the newbies in this channel, Kindly give me at least two days before I can get back to you. And if you happen to pass by my channel, please consider subscribing and hit that notification bell so you won't miss my upcoming videos. So stay tuned and enjoy watching. Let's go! Ayan, so finally, nandito na po tayo. Ang first stop natin, Manila Cathedral. Sisili po tayo sa Glet para tayo ay makapagdasal. 
Napakaganda talaga ng architectural design ng Manila Cathedral. Feeling mo, para ka nasa Europe. <laughs> so, let's go. Pasok tayo para makita natin kahit uh, saglit lang yung loob ng Manila Cathedral. Dati noon, pangarap ko dito ay kasal. <laughs> Kaso matagal ba na dito magpa-reserve? Ayan po, sobrang ganda di po ba? Grabe. So, ayan po, nalabas tayo at tayo ay sisilip naman sa Museo San Agustin. Ang mabilisan lang po kasi itong tour natin kasi napadaan lang kami dito, sumilip lang. Pasok po tayo. San Agustin Church is the oldest church in the Philippines. It was built in 1571, however, was wrecked by fire twice. The present building is reproduced in 1587. This museum has a collection of different artifacts and artworks from a former monastery adjacent to a landmark church. There's so much to see in this museum. Kaya kung meron kayong time, pwede yung dalhin yung mga anak dito. Anyways, nakita mo natin a glimpse of uh, Museo San Agustin. So tayo ay lilipat sa Museo Maritimo or Maritime Museum. Museo Maritimo is dedicated to the Filipino seafarers. It is located at Hulunatpil Street. Did you know that the Philippines has been considered as the mining capital of the world in the maritime industry? Filipino seafarers comprise the majority of the world's 1.5 million strong maritime personnel. Behind the conceptualization of Museo Marino, is the Associated Maritime Officers and Seamen's Union of the Philippines or AMOSOP. Inside the museum, you can find replicas of the type of vessels that many Filipino seafarers serve on. There are also other instruments and other equipments used by seafarers providing a good idea of what it's like inside a vessel. The museum also features the work being done by the Amazon in advancing the welfare of the Filipino seafarers. A few moments later. So that's it for today, Mga Tribo. If you like this video, kindly give a thumbs up and please share it to your family and friends. Thank you. Muli po ang aking taos pusong pasalamat sa inyong muli pagsama sa akin ngayon. Maraming maraming salamat po. Mag-iingat po tayong palagi sa ating pang-araw-araw na pakikipagsaklaran sa buhay para sa ating mga pamilya. God bless us all and see you on my next video. Woohoo!